Oh, it's time to start class. All right, five, four, three, two, one, listening. Thank you. That was a good job quieting down. Uh, let's go ahead and take attendance. Table one, is everybody there? Mm -hmm. Table two, is everybody over there? Nobody's there. Table three, are you there? That's right, you guys are all at distance learning. But you know what that means. I get to take off my mask. Uh, welcome everybody. Uh, if you don't know, this is what the bottom half of my face looks like. Uh, yes, I did get new glasses. I know, they're beautiful. Uh, welcome to distance learning. I hope you all are ready for this. We're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and get started. Welcome everybody to Art with Mr. White, yay! Uh, virtual learning is going to be a little bit different than your normal classes. Um, if you were in discovering art or exploring art or 3D art, you are now going to be combined into what I call virtual art. Uh, that just means that we're going to be learning at home. Um, I hope that all of you are staying safe, staying home. Uh, I hope that everybody in your families are doing okay, and I hope that everything is going all right. So we are going to be making lots of different types of art in this virtual learning of ours. We are going to be taking some pictures of found objects around our house. We're gonna be creating some conceptual art. We're gonna be learning a little bit about art history during this unit. Uh, and then we're gonna move on to a digital art unit where we're gonna be talking about the elements of art and the principles of design. But before we get into any of the actual assignments, I just wanna kinda of go over some of the basic rules of how this is gonna be working. Uh, number one, uh, make sure that you are listening carefully. I'm gonna be giving instructions like this through a video. I'm also gonna be giving written out instructions uh, and I will be available during Zoom time to ask any questions and I should be able to answer them, hopefully. Um, if you're not available for any of those, I'm always available through email as well. So please make sure though that when, you, when I am giving you instructions that you are listening so that way you are not getting lost along the way. Um, follow the directions. I'm trying to spell this out as best I can, but sometimes everything is not clear. And if that is the case, please let me know. I don't want you to get left behind during this time. I know it's so hard when we're so far away, but please make sure that you are following the directions. Uh, work hard. If you work hard during this time, you're gonna be just fine. Uh, I am always grading more on the effort that I see between the Zoom and your final products and whether or not you are putting in the effort along the way. Um, Respect others. There will be times when we're going to be having discussions in either Zoom or uh, through forums on Schoology. So please make sure that when you are interacting with one another that you are being respectful. Um, and my last rule, and this one might be my favorite, pretend like you want to be here. I know none of us actually want to be at home right now trying to do this distance learning thing, but I want you to at least pretend. I know we would all rather get to see our friends every day and be here, and I would rather see your smiling faces rather than 30 empty chairs in my room every day. But please make sure that when we are interacting with each other, at least pretend. It doesn't have to be real. Just pretend like you wanna be here, all right? So those are my basic rules that we're gonna go over. I'm sure there will be other stuff that comes up, but please make sure that you are following those basic rules. All right, everybody, I did say that we were gonna be looking a little bit into art history and I'm introducing a new thing that we're gonna be doing each day in these videos and I'm gonna call this the AWTD, the ah to da That's right, it's time for the artwork of the day. I'm gonna be making my way through all of these different artists that I have behind me and that you get to see in my classroom all the time, but you probably don't know anything about. Today, we're gonna to be starting off up here with this guy right here. His name is Romero Brito. Okay, he was born in Brazil, 
Uh, he moved to America in the late 1980s and currently lives in Florida, and he's still living, still making art today. This is one of his works of art. As you can see, it is very bright, it's very colorful, and it includes something from pop culture. That's right, Coca-Cola. This work of art is called Coca-Cola Number no. One, Sharing. Uh, it's got very bright, very vibrant colors. Um, it was made in 2016, so as you can tell, it's still pretty recent. Uh, what's very interesting about this art is that he takes very simple shapes, very bright colors, and he brings it all together to make something that is super recognizable while still referencing pop culture. That's why it's called pop art. Thank you so much. We're going to move on to our first assignment of the day. Okay, let's go. I'm back. Okay, our first assignment that we're going to be working on is simply to upload something to Schoology. You're going to either work digitally or on paper. What you're going to do is you are just going to simply write, Hi, Mr. White, to let me know that you're alive. Uh, you can make it creative. You can draw something to go with it. You can just write the words. You can type it out. You can do it digitally. It doesn't really matter how you do it as long as you make something that says, Hi, Mr. White. You're going to take a picture of it, upload it onto your computer, and then upload that to Schoology. Uh, that's your first assignment. Basically, we're just practicing uploading something to Schoology and trying to learn how to take a picture. Uh, I am going to include some links for how to transfer things from phones or cameras onto a computer for those of you who may not know how to do that. Uh, I'm also going to include a link with a video of how to upload something to Schoology. If you've never done it before, you're gonna get really used to it with all this distance learning. You're gonna become pros, trust me, you're gonna do great. If you have any questions, please email me, come to my Zoom meeting, uh, I wanna see your faces. If you don't feel comfortable showing me your face, that's okay, I wanna still hear your voice at the Zoom meeting. Come and talk to me, I wanna see what's up. How was your Thanksgiving break? I wanna know. I'm kind of bored in this classroom if you can't tell when nobody's here. Okay, I hope everybody's doing great. Keep safe, keep making art, have a good day. Bye.